Hey everybody, welcome to a new video. So we're looking at the brand new Thunder XT HD version. You can of course see that I'm using it in the garage here. It looks really nice. Also, the garage for Tanky's 15th birthday also looks really nice. Well done to them for that. Now let's look at the old version and see the big difference here. Here we have the new and then bam to the old. Clearly looks a bunch different. The big thing is that it looks a little bit bigger and it definitely fits with Viking XT because you look at the old XT, it just doesn't really fit all that well with the updated graphics. It looks just like there's something wrong there. But then you have the updated one looks really good. I'm going to hop into battle, see what it looks like with a bunch of different paints on. All right, we are in game now. It took me a while to find a map to actually make this look really good. But let's take a nice 360 view here. It looks very, very nice. Obviously, it's going to look nice with the graphic design that Tanky's been doing recently. All their new skins look pretty darn nice. I mean, yeah, it looks really nice. You can see when I shoot, it has a nice reactive little portion to it. And then the top opens up for the shell to move out and eject. Definitely looks really nice. I'm honestly excited to see what it looks like with all the different paints in the game. Just the different color palettes are always cool to see. Now I'm honestly hoping this isn't the only new skin we get for Tanky's birthday. Because last year we had Viking XTHD as well as Freeze XTHD. We're probably going to be getting a Tanky birthday fund. And on top of that, probably a new mini game or some sort of other event going on. Now if they add a Tanky fund, I'm not exactly sure if we're going to get another event. But for the Tanky fund, we have to get a new skin. I mean, they can't just reuse Hunter. GT again because they've already fully released that to the game. You were able to get it for a previous event, but let's be honest, I don't think many people care about Hunter GT. So it'd be cool if we got another whole XTHD, maybe Hunter, maybe Wasp. Honestly, one of the OG ones like Hornet would also be pretty cool to see a brand new HD version of that. This definitely just looks really incredible with the Viking XTHD in here. Now, this skin is obtainable in Ultra Containers, so if you're somewhat lucky and you have a decent amount of the items in the game, you might be able to get this skin. I'm 100% not expecting to get it on my main account because I already need to get so many different items and ultra containers. So the chances of me getting an exotic are already low, but getting this specific exotic, um, yeah, it's gonna be very, very difficult, which is why ultra containers are kind of annoying because it's really luck based, especially if you want to get a specific item. That's my big annoyance with containers. To be fair though, I'd rather it be in containers than be in a mini game where let's be honest, unless you spend a thousand dollars, you're not going to get it. So it's nice that at least one new skin is in containers. And if you're going to buy containers for Tanky's birthday, don't forget to use Crit Tag Taspins because it does help me out a ton. I've really been enjoying these new skins. Unfortunately, we only get like one every three or four months. It's kind of annoying when you have to wait forever in between skins. And at the end of the day, I don't think any players are really getting these skins, but it's, you know, it's nice to look at. That's why I like to make videos because at the end of the day, even if you don't get one, it's always nice to see new skins. It's like in other video games where they always give new skins for different guns or operators or whatever you want to call them. It's always nice to see them, even if you're not going to get it at the end of the day. I'm hoping we get the old MO through M3 skins in the future, just so, you know, maybe there's a free option for players who don't really have that many skins. Definitely let me know what you guys think about this brand new Thunder XTHD skin. I really like it. Obviously, at the end of the day, one new skin that's in Ultra Containers isn't super, super exciting because let's be honest, you're not going to get it. It'd be a lot nicer if they added this to the Elite Pass so people who save up tank wins could at least maybe grind out for it rather than hoping to get lucky. But yeah, let me know down in the comments below if you like it. Don't forget to use Crypto Taspins in Item Shop. I'll see you guys in a future video. Peace out, everyone.